As we inch closer to the beginning of the season, players and coaches are pushing each other after just missing the playoffs last year. It's been competitive. Uh, kids have been working really hard. Uh, very pleased with the work they put in. Uh, the competition has been um, uh, at another level this year, so I, that's been exciting to see, and it's been fun to watch. The biggest battle in fall camp is for the starting quarterback position, as three players are neck to neck on who will be under center to begin the season. We don't know who to start. They're all competing at a high level, so I mean, hopefully we'll know soon. The guys are all performing well. They're all like doing their reads, doing their checks pretty good. So I mean, whoever we roll with, I'm excited to go with them because we go score for sure. On the defensive side of the ball. SVSU feels pretty confident with several all GLIAC players returning this season. The defense is better than ever. I think we got the best squad that we've had in a while. We're super deep in all our skill positions, all our D-line positions, all our linebacker positions. So we really got a lot of depth and we're, we're all hungry to, to go out there and, and get that ball. And with a new season in front of them, the Cardinals are devoted to getting back to the postseason this year. We're competing at a high level um, and, and I believe our kids believe that um, you know that they can do it and so uh, it'll be, it's going to be exciting to see and uh, I'm really looking forward to this season. SPSU will have a tough schedule to begin their year with five of their first six games going against playoff teams. They'll kick off the season at home against Winona State on August 31st for the Red Feather game. At SPSU, Cole Martins, WNEM TV 5 Sports.